In an ideal world, all project reviews would take place in a live meeting. Changes can be made on the fly, and teams can act quickly and decisively. For many project teams, however, remote collaboration has become the norm. This video will cover several capabilities in iRise that enable teams to collaborate more effectively during every phase of a requirements definition project. Communicating with project stakeholders at the beginning of a review cycle is crucial. A start page is an important tool for reinforcing project goals and orienting stakeholders to the review process. An effective start page is one that can be standardized and reused across projects. Using the import capability in iRise, let's grab our organization's standard set of components. Now that the components are in our directory, we can set our start page by right-clicking a page and choosing Start Page. Typically, we might customize the page with project-specific information, but for now we'll just fix the link to our scenario. Let's check out what our reviewers will see when they open our project. Our start page provides our stakeholders with some background information regarding both our project and the process of reviewing a simulation. We've also added some project documentation tools to keep everything in one place. Most importantly, we've provided a link that launches the scenario we want our stakeholders to review. A start page is just that, a start. To get the best feedback possible from your reviewers, the communication should continue throughout your simulation. This is accomplished using guides. You will use guides to provide contextual information to reviewers as they progress through a simulation. Depending on the needs of your project, the information you provide might range from high-level descriptions to highly detailed walkthrough notes. For even more context, a guide can be associated with a specific object on the page. Let's see how this looks to our reviewer. For your reviewers, guides will be enabled automatically. Since we launched the simulation from Studio, we need to enable guides. As you can see, the page guide opens automatically when the page loads. The widget guide only opens if we hover our mouse over the widget or click the guide icon. Once the project is open in the reader, you can take advantage of the integrated commenting features. Let's say a reviewer feels that the bold font for the email address field is not a clear enough indication that this is a required field. This reviewer would simply add a comment and associate it with a field label. The comment appears instantly both here on the Definition Center and here in Studio. Comments can be flagged with different colors, opened and closed, and exported to a CSV file. The collaboration features in iRise are what make it such a unique and powerful requirements definition platform. The communication tools you saw in this video, in addition to some key reporting tools like the requirements document and project XML, provide teams with a solid foundation for project success.